Hey everyone, welcome to Computer Science 001 or Programming Concepts and Methods 1. I'm going to show you how to install Microsoft Visual Studios 2022 for your computer if you have a Windows. Uh, it's going to be in modules. I've created a, a link for it there for you. And we'll do the student view so you can see what I'll show you what you're seeing at this point. Click on Microsoft Visual C++. And we have the official website right here. I'm going to click on that. And I'm just going to say download Visual Studios and we're going to choose Community 2022. Community 2022 is free and it allows you to use your COS, your login information. So once it's downloaded, go ahead and install it. And I, this might take a second, but I already have the installer installed. Uh, the next part does take a little while. So let's see what happens when it gets here. All right, so when we get here, some things that you want to click on and activate, you want to definitely have desktop development with C++ highlighted. I recommend uh, doing the one with universal Windows platform. If you decide you want to make some apps or something like that, you could always add this later if you don't want to do it now. I'm going to use it though. And I'm going to do the mobile development there. I'm also playing around with game development with Unity. So I'm going to add those as well. Uh, in class, we're just doing the C++. So choose what you want to install. Notice it is kind of big. This uh, Everything I selected is 20 gigs. Let me turn off the other ones and show you just how minimal it can be. It can be as small as five and a half gigs. Uh, but I'm going to, well, I'll come back in and do that later. Let's, let's just do the desktop development now. And I'll show you how to modify it when you come back in later. So I have the previous Visual Studios Community 2019. They just came out with 2022, like a, after Halloween, and it, it works really great. But notice that it does take a while. And remember, this first one was 5.5 gigs. This is only doing 1.47 right now. So it's got to, it's going to do this a couple of times. This one's got a really nice IntelliSense program, which will auto fill in things that you might want to type. Uh, it can help while you're learning. It can help while you're coding. But ideally, you will know all these commands without the IntelliSense. Not everything has this. And you will learn these commands over this co course of the semester. Looks like this first section is almost done downloading. Notice it's still got a few packages to go. This should be a fun semester. We have the sign president, Adrian Macias. He's going to be our SI for the class. This is for fall or spring of 2022. And uh, he knows what he's doing. Uh, we might have Professor Woodbury sitting in on from time to time. Uh, he taught this class a while ago. And he just wants to see what kind of new content has been added and do a little refresher for himself. Almost done installing. Let's see what happens shortly. Still finishing up. There we go. See, it pops up. That's the installer. This is 
Visual Studios. Now, if you haven't signed in, you need to sign in. Use your school email and your password. And here we are. All right. Uh, that's pretty much it on installing it. Those are all, ooh, it's got all my old codes that I wrote. Nice. So that's there. Uh, when you want to go back, if you want to add more stuff to it, you can always go into your history here, your games or uh, programs, Visual Studios, do the installer again. We already have it open. Uh, and if you want to add stuff to it, like the Unity and stuff I was talking about, you can go in and click Modify. And now I'm going to add in the other stuff that I wanted to do. I thought, it... oh, that's 2019. That's why. Uh, here we go. Modify that one. There we go. This is the one I wanted to modify. I'm going to add in my ability to make applications or apps and Unity. And I'll click modify and get it going, but you don't need that. Everything you need is uh, right here. So that's it for that. Peace.